Hi everyone! So I thought it was time that I got around to opening up my bunny box that I have had for a few weeks now and of course due to recent events I have been a bit delayed in opening it until now and filming a video so I hope that you'll forgive me for that. Um, so the story behind this box is that I had a message on YouTube from months and months ago um, seeing if I wanted to receive a box in return for doing uh, an unboxing and review video um, which I most definitely did but by the time I saw the message it had been so long that I, I was convinced that they wouldn't still want to send me one but I got in touch anyway because I'd had a look on their website and thought that they sounded like a really good company and they um, supply all natural products and you can have the subscription service or you can order a one-off box so you've got lots of choices and everything is natural healthy suitable for rabbits and guinea pigs so I thought it sounded ideal and um, Luckily for me, they did agree to send me a box, so thank you very much for that. So I think it's about time that me and the piggies take a look at what's inside. <laughs> I think Willow is already investigating. So the first thing that I just want to mention is that um, the little box that they send everything in is really cute. It's got like personalised um, little signs and designs around it and uh, yeah <laughs> that made me smile when it came uh, in the post so this is what you see when you open it up and there's this lovely little leaflet in here thanking you for your order it says that we have included lots of yummy treats food and toys for your rabbit to enjoy this month but of course like i said before everything is also suitable for guinea pigs so rabbits and guinea pigs Oh, we've got some little cute pictures of rabbits enjoying their treats and it says that we would love to see pictures of your rabbit enjoying their bunny box and then down there it's got the links to everything that we need to know, their Facebook, their Twitter, Instagram and the email there. Oh, so this is quite exciting. It's been a long time since the, the piggies have got um, any new treats and snacks. Um, I don't usually get them things just because they seem happy enough with their hay and the vegetables, but it is really nice to get them some things now and again just to add that extra enrichment for them. So first thing here I have the Nature First Blackcurrant and Dandelion Leaf Mix and that looks really yummy. It's just the type of things that all guinea pigs really enjoy and rabbits too I'm sure because it's that nice dried leafy stuff they just find it really tasty and really easy to eat so I am sure that they will absolutely love that. <laughs> They're already having a nosy. Aren't you Lyra? Are you already looking? <laughs> And that's a really big bag as well actually, you can kind of get an idea of how big it is, so that is going to last them a long long time I'm sure. Next up we have, ooh, sunflower petal and chamomile flower mix, wow that sounds quite exotic. I'd, I'd be quite interested to see whether they'd like this or not. And, and underneath it says to help reduce stress in your small animal. Sorry about Willow, she's just taking it out on the box, aren't you? No! And so are you, naughty. Making noises. <laughs> so that also looks really yummy and that's a smaller, that's half as much, so that's a 50 gram bag there. Which is fine because it's nice to have a variety of things. Ooh! So third thing I've got is another big bag and this is yarrow flower nibbles. Wow, that looks real. I've seen yarrow growing in the garden actually, um, but I've never thought that they could have it, but they obviously can. And as I said, that's another really big bag, so that would last them a long time. So fingers crossed they do enjoy that one. We've got one of these. So again, nature first. It seems like everything in this box is nature first. Um, we have one of the willow balls. As I'm sure you all know, these types of chews are all natural, just made from willow, and they're really good for them to chew down on, wear their incisors down on, and just be a toy as well for them. Um, maybe rabbits would be more interested at throwing this and playing with this kind of toy. Um, my guinea pigs will show a little bit of interest, but um, not an awful lot, but we'll, we'll see see how they get on. <laughs> Next up, ooh, we've got dried apple nibbles. I'm sure they will like that they've had kind of dried apple from the Burgess XL range before, so I'm sure that they will enjoy that one as well. <laughs> Everything's piling up over there, Willow's having a look. 
Oh, and we're not done yet. We also have another willow toy. Oh, this is quite cool. This is a willow spiral, so that's like a kind of different design. I don't know whether I've seen this in uh, the shops, actually. I've seen the willow ball type design before, but this is just uh, something a bit different, which I'm sure that they will enjoy chewing on, and um, it'll just add la that little bit of natural touch to the cage as well, which is nice. <laughs> Lyra's just eating the little leaflet. <laughs> Naughty piggy! <laughs> and of course it doesn't stop with what's inside the box. The box itself can be used as a great hideaway toy for your rabbits and guinea pigs as well. Mine absolutely love cardboard boxes. Um, whenever I have one lying around, instead of just putting it straight in the recycling, I'll always give it to them to play with for a bit. And they can get a bit of enrichment from that. So we've got such a nice range of goodies here. I'm really excited to get them out and see if the guinea pigs like them. Um, as you can see, I've got Nature First range. Um, I've got three, no, four treats and the two um, Willow chew toys as well. But I had a little nosy on the website to see what other brands that they include in the boxes. And I found that they also do the Rosewood Naturals range. They've had Burgess XL things in their boxes before. They've had the Rosewood box and breaker, um, wooden chew type toys and they've had nature first stuff as well. So they really do go for all the kind of best natural brands which is really nice to see. So if you're someone that quite often finds yourself buying these type of things for your rabbits or guinea pigs then I think it's a really good thing to do. Um, as I said before you don't need to get the subscription, you can just order one-off boxes when you feel like you're ready. And another good thing about doing that is that they say the retail price of everything in the box actually comes to more than you pay for the box itself so as well as giving you all this lovely healthy natural stuff they're also saving you money as well which is fabulous so they certainly get a big thumbs up from me now let's see what the piggies think <laughs> So today's video is an unboxing of a lovely package who I suspect is from Carrie.